Hey, yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Chris from YouTube, and welcome back to At Dead of Night. We're making moves, we're making strides, because in the last video, we completed Amy's story, we got pretty far into Dr. Bose's story, we started Harvey's story. After that, we just have to start uh, Rose's story. I, I got mixed up in the brain because I was thinking of Dr. Bose and Rose, Dr. Bose, and Red. It, it fucked me up. But... I have checked every room on... Shut up, Jimmy! I have checked every room on the first floor, the second floor, and I have three or four more rooms left to check on the third floor. I have found all the items that I can, so it should, after I like check the last four rooms, it should just be a matter of avoiding Jimmy and going to the places that the game wants me to go for talking with the spirits. So I'm in room 307 right now. I need to check 303, 304, 5, and 6. Okay, 303 is locked. And 304 is a dark room. <laughs> We're off to a great start this video. Off to a great start, indeed. What is it with all the locked doors up here? Why are all the doors locked up here? Okay. Broken wall mirrors. Fuck! No! 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 I cannot trust this because the last time he closed the door on me, I jumped out and he got me anyways. He was hiding in the bathroom. So I need to be absolutely sure that he is gone. And I don't know how to do that. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Okay, wait, where am I supposed to go again? I needed to do something. Ah, uh, fuck, I'm gonna have to use the scrying mirror. Ah! Ah! Bitch, I told you! I fucking told you! Ha! Ah! Ha! Ah! Why? Ha! Ah! Ha! Ah! Ha! Ah! Ha! Ah! He took all my keys again. Ah! I fucking told you. Did he put me on the third floor? Am I am I I'm on the third floor. Okay. So Dr. Bose should still be should still be on the first floor, right? No, wait. Uh we saw Dr. Bose in the bathroom. Oh, yeah, that's right, that's right, that's right. I'm supposed to be looking for my, my thingy. Is anyone there? Hello? Okay. Is it Dr. Bose? So we now have... Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. Everything. How did those mirrors get broken? I didn't see them. Um... What have I tried? What haven't I done so far? I saw a man saying Jimmy had lied about the assault. Who was he? It was Harvey. He knew Jimmy was lying about me. Harvey understood. Who wrote the note that says goodbye? I don't 
Okay. Okay. I. What haven't I added to the pair? Jimmy had put broken glass in my sandwich. I nearly choked. I realized. What if Harvey. With Harvey knowing that he was lying, what if we add that with the cloth? When you said Harvey knew Jimmy was lying, does that have something to do with the blood-stained cloth? Alright. Um, step up his treatment. Wooden paddle? When you said you needed to step up Jimmy's treatment urgently, oh. is that connected to what you said about the wooden paddle? Damn it, man! Fuck it! I'm gonna use the scrying mirror just to give myself a refresher. But after that, I should need to use it no more! That's Harvey. A syringe. And that's Dr. Bose, I think. Why'd he get so close and open his mouth like that? Okay, so I may have had those two mixed up. Maybe... Maybe Dr. Bose was the syringe. So we're gonna pair that with the diazepam. I mean, we've kind of talked about that before, though. When you though. said you needed to step up Jimmy's treatment urgently, does that have something to do with what you said about the diazepam? It wasn't the ideal medication, but it I was swear I tried that already! Jimmy needed treating immediately. He was dangerous. I swear I tried that already! Okay, floor two should help me complete Dr. Bose's story. Or whatever it is I need to do. Jimmy's a bitch. And he knows it. He knows he is. We all know it. Anybody a part of the Jimmy fan club is not in my fan club. Around here. I smell it. We're close. This won't hurt. I was expecting you. that. All you have to do is to stand still and stop moving around. I was expecting it. That was good. That was good, but I was surely expecting it. Is he in this room? Yes. All right, Bosey boy. Eh! No, not that! Eh! 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 Is it Dr. Bose? Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. I saw you with a needle talking to Jimmy. What were you doing? Jimmy refused to let me administer the drug. I wonder why. Okay, okay, all right. So Dr. Bose, um, what can I use as evidence for this? Uh, maybe the paddle? When you said Jimmy refused to let you administer his medicine, is that connected to what you said about the wooden paddle? Jimmy said I used the paddle to beat him. Yeah! Dude, I'm so smart. <laughs> I'm such a genius. So 
a rotary phone. Okay. So do I have to go to the ground floor? Jimmy could most definitely be on this. Yep, he's on this floor. Go, 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 go. I'm not trusting it. I'm not trusting it. Go, go. So I saw a rotary phone. <clears throat> the only floor. <clears throat> Excuse me. The only floor I can think that has a rotary phone. Use force like that on a patient, Mrs. Hall. It goes against everything I believe in. You have to understand, he's making it all up. Ah, uh, I'm so sorry you had to deal with that, Dr. Bose. Is it Dr. Bose? Is it Dr. Bose? Yes. Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. I saw you trying to explain what happened with Jimmy. You seem desperate. I was worried that the Rose would believe Jimmy. It was a bare-faced lie. But I managed to convince Rose Jimmy was making it up. Damn, Dr. Bose, you have quite the story going on here. I felt like at this point we'd be done. <laughs> All right, we still haven't met Rose yet, but I feel like once we get a little bit more information from Harvey, we can uh, figure out what to do about Rose. I wonder if you can get all four stories going at the same time. All right, be prepared, be prepared. Um, where is it pointing? Okay, probably this way. Shut up, Jimmy. Shut up. Just for a second. Hmm. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Jump scare me. Yeah. Look, he looks like John Cena. I don't know if any of you have noticed it. I don't know if any of you, <laughs> but you know what I'm talking about. Taking a risk. I'm a risk taker. Oh, what the hell? Move into the room. What the hell? Unlock the door first. What? This is mad weird. Okay. Alright, this is a dark storeroom. Um. So then that's probably. That's probably where I need to go. But I don't have the, the key for this room. Unlock the door first. Fuck! Do I have to go back and search for. Oh, oh, Jimmy, please, Jimmy, please, Jimmy, please, Jimmy, please, Jimmy, please, Jimmy, please, be nice, be nice, be nice. Okay. Well, there we go. There's that storeroom key. So what did that do? That doesn't help at all. Oh, but that does. This is the room I need to be in. Oh. Be prepared. Be prepared. No, not that. There's someone there. That's loud. Who's there? 
What do you mean? I'm most definitely supposed to be in here, right? All signs point to this door. Maybe I need to progress through Harvey's story a little bit more. But in order to do that, I need to get off the second floor. I believe you. That's why I'm doing everything in my power to avoid you. I'm not doing a very good job at that. Fuck! It's a dark room! Fuck me! Shit, fuck! We're good. We're good. So I need to remember that 216. What? Hello? Who's banging on shit? Is it this room? Yes. Am I not doing something right? Come on, do your thing. Do the thing. Do the roar. <coughs> I cannot do that. My voice is not built for that today for some reason. I didn't mean to do that! Fuck! Is it Harvey? You want me out in the hallway? Hose! He can't get me while I'm communicating with the spirits, right? This might be a stupid question, but he can't get me while I'm communicating with the spirits. Is it Harvey? Is it Harvey? Yo, this is a predicament. The third floor is only so big. No, 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 no. I'm off to a horrible start. Yeah, I know, but I need to communicate Who's with the that? spirits. I can hear you. Okay. Is it Harvey? <laughs> yes. Okay, we're gonna find out if Jimmy can hurt me while I'm talking to the spirits. 
I saw you shouting. Because I'm just in the middle of the hallway now. Did he? Okay, so we'll do this and let's see, setting traps, maybe setting traps, setting traps. Jimmy stole the sword? When you said Jimmy started setting traps for you, does that have anything to do with what you said about the sword? Hmm. Uh, the trap and the electric heater? Where's it at? When you said Jimmy started setting traps for you, does that have anything to do with what you said about the dangerous heater? Jimmy was always playing with electricity. Yeah, 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 yeah! Ah. Please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me, Jimmy. 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 Ah! Nothing to it. <laughs> Nothing to it. I hear it. Okay, well, <laughs> we know what we need to do. Oh, be prepared. No, don't hide in the bathroom. There's no need for that. Is it Harvey? Is it Harvey? Yeah, it's Harvey. I saw Are you good, bro? Shock. What happened? You good? He knew that was my heater. He you know, had the casing straight to the mains. Almost killed me. He did it deliberately. But Rose wouldn't have it. I knew he needed to be taught a lesson. He damaged my property, so I decided to damage his. Okay. So let's add that with the broken mirror. How did those mirrors get broken? I don't remember that. Oh! What? Yes, you do, you lying bitch. Oh, he kept the bats in case he needed them. Maybe that's... When you said you decided to damage his property, does that have something to do with what you said about the crickets and baseball bats? I kept those bats for self-defense. See, I got it. Once I find all the items and check all the rooms, I'm in the clear. So both Dr. Bose and um, Harvey's stories continue on the second floor. No, why do I keep checking that? And the one thing I realized is that after looking through the, the spyglass on 216, or looking through the spyglass for Harvey, I might be able to do that for, what's his face? 216 is this way. Let's try looking through the, the glass on this one. Nothing. Maybe let's try hiding in the bathroom? Nothing. So what do they want me to come in here for? Oh, okay. You can't get away from me that easily, Jimmy. I think we should start again, don't you? Ew. Why don't you do what I ask you to do this time? 
Oh. That would be a good start, wouldn't it? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No, you're both in the wrong at this point. Because that felt very, very sexual. Is it Dr. Bose? Ah, I didn't like that one. Yes, it's me. I saw you sitting on a bed talking to Jimmy. What were you doing? I thought when he realized he'd been caught lying, he'd start to engage with me and do what I asked. Oh! Instead, he just made up another lie. Only this one was much worse. The worst. Uh, let's go ahead and pair that with the wire. The washing line. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the washing line and rolling pin? Fuck! Um... Hmm. It can't be the coil. It's not the bats. You didn't have an answer for that. The hotel used to have a display of old weapons? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it could be! I'm gonna try the coil. Oh. Coil. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Is that connected to what you said about the coil of wire? <sighs> Let's try the crossbow? You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the crossbow? Shit. So I've got like one more try before I can't communicate with him anymore. I'm gonna try adding that to a pair and then the broken glass. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Is that connected to what you said about the broken mirrors? That's not gonna be it. Damn it! Wait a while before trying to make contact again. Shit! Okay. No, stop looking through there. Alright, so I gotta try and figure out where Harvey's story continues. You good, bro? Hey, bro, you good? You're not done yet. He said I'm not done. I'm not done making a mess. Uh, should I have contacted him outside the room? Is it Harvey? Yeah, it's Harvey. Okay. I saw you with a bat coming out of the room. What had you done? Most of his television and games consoles and stuff. I was angry. But it didn't work. It just made him worse. He soon retaliated. Alright. Harvey. Uh with the ornate dagger. When you said Jimmy soon retaliated, does that have anything to do with what you said about the dagger? <laughs> okay. Uh, he soon retaliated. Let's see. Hmm. The fire. When you said Jimmy soon retaliated, is that connected to what you said about the fire in the hotel? Please, please. No! That would seem like the perfect retaliation. <laughs> Somebody destroys your video game console, so you burn down their hotel. Simple. The coil. When you said Jimmy soon retaliated, is that connected to what you said about the coil of wire? No, 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 because he would have no, he had no idea why. Shit. I really got to be careful about my choices. 
Uh, so this doesn't have anything to do with it. This wasn't it. This wasn't it. Uh, okay. So these are my last three choices. I can only pick one because after that, it's going to tell me that I have to wait a while before trying to contact the spirit again. So I want to say the crossbow was from an armory display we had. Jimmy was fond of it. So he said Jimmy was fond of it. When you said Jimmy, C retaliated. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the crossbow? Please! Jimmy was fond <laughs> I hadn't seen him all night after it smashed his stuff. I should have guessed he'd been working on his next little trick. Got it. So, Harvey was shot by an arrow. What the hell is that noise? Is someone there? Dr. Bose? Hello? Is it Dr. Bose? I'm Dr. Bose, yes. All right, sat on the bed. So it wasn't the broken glass. It wasn't the note. Maybe he lied about the gun. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have something to do with what you said about the gun? I don't know. Ah, God. Why am I struggling so much? Oh wait, let's ask him about the I bat. I saw Harvey with a bat coming out of a room. What had he done? I don't know, but violence only makes things worse. Coming from somebody who sat on the bed and said, let's start over. So I'm starting to wonder if there are items that I'm missing. Like there are rooms on my notes from each floor that were locked. And I don't know if they were locked because Jimmy locked them and I had already checked them or so on floor one, there are locked doors 110, 111, and 115 are locked, and 121 as well. Um, floor two, I think, had a couple locked doors. It doesn't look like floor two had any locked doors, actually. But I know floor three had one locked door. So I'm wondering if I didn't get all the items because I haven't gotten the keys for those doors. I don't, I don't know. Uh, because none of the items that I'm trying are working. He has no answers for any of these. He doesn't know anything about the suitcase. We already did the bloodstained cloth. And then you'd think that if it were something Jimmy lied about, I don't know, because he didn't see anything about the broken mirrors. He doesn't know anything about the letter. He doesn't know why Harvey kept the bats, but we know why, because we talked to Harvey about the bats. He doesn't have an answer about the dagger. Nothing about the Hugo punch poster. Hadn't heard of the fire. We already tried the crossbow before. I'm gonna try the turpentine and lighter, I don't think. But it, all it says is you better ask Jimmy. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? I don't know. I wish once we finished a story, it would get rid of all the items that we no longer need. Because obviously I don't need to ask him about Amy's purse. I don't need to ask anybody about Amy's purse because Amy's purse, or I mean Amy's story is over. We've completed that story. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Is that connected to what you said about the broken mirrors? Okay, um, I'm going to try and figure out what's going on with Harvey. Okay, 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 okay. He for sure saw me come in here. 
But it's gonna be okay. Yep. He for sure saw me. he took he took all of my keys this time I have no keys oh my god stop looking through there uh. being shot in the leg with an arrow. What happened? Jimmy had set it up to fire when I opened the door. I had to go into A and E, get stitches and tetanus shots. When I got back, I couldn't find him. Rose said he was hiding in the basement. I gave me an idea. Oh. So this, and then the keys to the boiler room. When you said you thought Jimmy would like hiding in the basement, does that have something to do with those rusty keys? Well, if Jimmy wanted to hide down there, I thought he must like it. Uh, I gotta go back down to the basement. Alright, that works. I just gotta avoid Jimmy while I get to the elevator. Which should be easy. I should be able to avoid him. I'm not avoiding him at all. I don't know why I keep coming down this hallway. I should know better than this. No! 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 I saw him! I fucking saw him! Oh no! Oh no! I saw him out of the corner of my eye. I, I saw, he was, he was right here. He was right. Stop looking through there! No, don't call out to him. Down here. <laughs> I don't even think he's on this floor. It's fine. What floor am I on? Two? Okay, he might still be on this floor. I hate it because how the fuck do I get out of here? Alright, boiler room. <laughs> you can stay in there for the night, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm only <ready now. laughs> Lights? Is anyone there? Is it Harvey? Is he not down here? He is not down here. This way. Shut, Shut up. Is anyone there? Okay. So my thingy thing not thinging. Maybe this is like an Amy situation. Be prepared. Be prepared. Uh, I don't know what floor should I go to. Brown.
Because after I did that thing, it wasn't... It wasn't pointing me towards the spirit. This is new. I haven't been in here before. But where am I supposed to go? So he's not in the basement anymore. A compass isn't pointing towards anything. So where should I go? I know I haven't completed Harvey's story. I know that's not it. The compass isn't pointing towards anything here either. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go back and talk to Dr. Bose. Cause that's really all I can do. I, I He hasn't even said anything to me about Rose. I have nothing on Rose. What do you know about Harvey locking Jimmy, Harvey in the locking Jimmy in the basement? Probably what nothing. I saw Harvey being shot in the leg with an arrow. What happened? I don't know. Okay. Sat on the bed. Uh... <sighs> You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have something to do with what you said about the scrapbook? Jimmy accused me of the worst crime possible. He took it from a newspaper story he'd read. He was making it all up. So, I didn't even see where I was supposed to go after figuring that out. Um, I think this is a good place to stop. We got some good information. You know, we, we figured out a lot of things that happened with Jimmy and Dr. Bose and Harvey. We still have yet to meet Rose, but do I want to stop? Let me just look at the scrying mirror and see if there's just give me give me a second to think. So both of those are on the ground floor. I certainly could have figured that out, but you know, whatever. No, don't hide in the bathroom. God damn it. I thought I was facing the door. What? Who is it? I'm not responsible for anything that's happening here in this hotel. Why? I mean, Dr. Bose, same thing. Same guy. I 
saw you upset and heard the police banging on the door. What was going on? Rose reported me. I knew they'd strike me off. I had no career, no future. I decided to take control once and for all. Uh, they control once and for all. What could that mean? What could that mean? Maybe now I can say something about the washing line? When you said you decided to take control once and for all, does that have anything to do with what you said about the washing line and rolling pin? Okay. I found some rope instead. I still had my keys to the hotel, so I crept in one night while I was on bail. Oh my goodness! I want to be able to finish Dr. Bose's story. Where do I find Harvey, though? Be prepared. Oh no! Oh no! Is it Dr. Bose? Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. I saw you tying a rope around your neck. You killed yourself. Why? What do you mean, why? He was cooked! I'd had enough. He was cooked! There was no going back. My life was over anyway. He was cooked! He literally said himself that Rose had, li had, had reported him. And then he had no future, no career. Man's was cooked. And she wants to ask what happened. Sweet. Okay. We completed Dr. Bose's story. Oh my goodness. Okay. So, was Dr. Bose a resident of the hotel or did somebody call him? to get Jimmy help? Or did he just happen to be there and he was like, I'm a doctor, there's something wrong with this kid. So now we need to go to the stage. So because I'm gonna end the video here, <laughs> you thought I was gonna continue? I've been recording for a little too long. So I'm gonna keep a reminder for myself to go to the stage so that I don't have to use the scrying mirror because I'm definitely gonna forget between this video and the next video. Hopefully Harvey's story can be continued by going there because I know we were moving along with Harvey's story a little quickly. So the game was probably like, hold your horses. You need to finish this guy's story before you move on. I don't know. Uh, but we definitely do need to go to the stage. Harvey might have something to say about Rose. And then we might be able to move forward from there. We are now over halfway done with the story. So I'm pretty sure we might be able to finish this in like two more parts. Two or three more parts. If you want to see my last video, which was a game called A Difficult Game About Climbing, had a lot of fun with that, despite the rage and anger that you may see coming from me. That'll be linked somewhere around here. I recommend going to check that out. And if you want to see my last part of At Dead of Night, for some reason, if you haven't checked that out, that'll be linked somewhere around here as well. I'm going to get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And big body out.